What if I told you there's an application that solves a common problem of sharing files between all of your devices with different operating systems? Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Android, and iOS. All of them without relying on third-party services, complicated sign-ins, or even an internet connection. And then, what if I told you it's open source and completely free? Stick around. No more slow Bluetooth transfers. No more moving files around on USB drives. No restrictive services like AirDrop that only work within Apple's ecosystem. No reliance on cloud services like Google Drive or Microsoft's OneDrive. None of that. This video came about because the other day I'm outside around the house filming on my phone testing out a tripod and then as I was having to transfer the video to my computer to edit it I was a bit jealous of my Apple friends and I thought I've got to do something about this. Today we're talking about LocalSend. LocalSend is a free and open source file sharing application that allows users to transfer files wirelessly between devices without requiring an internet connection. It works by creating a direct connection over a local network, ensuring fast, private, and secure file transfers. Key features of LocalSend include completely free and open source, no ads, no subscriptions, and fully transparent development, no internet required. Transfer files over a local network without using the internet or cloud services. Cross-platform support. Works on Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Android, and iOS, making it a great alternative to AirDrop. Fast and secure transfers. Uses direct connections over Wi-Fi for high-speed file sharing while keeping data private and encrypted. Support for multiple file types. Send documents, photos, videos, and even entire folders effortlessly. Auto device discovery. Automatically detects other local send enabled devices on the same network for quick sharing. Simple and user-friendly interface. Minimal setup required, making it easy for anyone to use. No file size limits. Unlike cloud-based services, you can transfer large files without restrictions. Private and offline. No data is stored on external servers, ensuring complete privacy. Whether you're transferring files between a phone and a PC or sharing data between multiple computers, LocalSend provides a fast, reliable, and ad-free experience. Okay, let's go download LocalSend. We'll set it up and we'll transfer some files between different devices. Let's go. Real quick, do me a favor. If you're finding value in this video, please like and share the video and subscribe to the channel. It helps me out tremendously and allows me to keep bringing you content just like this. Thank you and let's get back to the video. Let's go ahead and head over to Google and type in local send. From the local send website, we'll go ahead and click download. Make sure you select the correct operating system. That's Windows for me. I'm going to choose the exe file. You'll see it download in the top right hand corner of my screen, which I will go ahead and click on. Accept the user control. My language is English. I'm okay with that location. I'm going to click next. I'm going to create a desktop icon for myself. You don't have to. Then I'm going to click install. And I'm going to click finish. And I'm going to allow the Windows security. And I'll go ahead and close out this browser. So here we have local send on the desktop. But as you can see, if I click on receive here, I don't have any other devices set up on the network right now. So let's go set up another device. I'm gonna use my Android phone. Okay, on my Android phone, just go to the Play Store going to type in local send. I'm going to click install. Once that installation is complete, I'm going to click open. And now we have it open on my Android device. I'm going to change my theme to dark here real quick. All right, now that I have it set up on my desktop, which is here to the left, and my cell phone, which is here to the right, I can send files seamlessly between the two devices. You can add multiple devices on different platforms 
if I were an iPhone person, which I am not, I could send this between my desktop, my Android, and my iPhones. So let's first send a video to my cell phone. So we're going to go to Send Files. I'm going to click on this video right here, and then all I have to do is click on Ray Android. And then on my cell phone, it's going to ask me if I want to accept the file. I'm going to click Accept. Okay. Once that's done, now I can go look at that video that I just downloaded. There's the video that I downloaded from my desktop computer. Now let's send a file to my desktop. So I'm going to go to Send, File. We'll send this photo here. I'm going to click on Ray Desktop. Now my desktop is asking do I want to accept the file from my phone. I'm going to click Accept and I can look at the picture I've received. So you can easily send files back and forth between any device. No AirDrop needed, no Google Drive needed, no Microsoft OneDrive needed. Okay, now let's go add it to a third device so that you can see how it automatically recognizes the first two devices on my network. All right, now you can see the first desktop that I added and the Android phone. So this is yet a third device. So now I can send files to the other two devices or as many devices as I want to add. And as soon as you set up the new device, it will recognize all of the existing devices on the local network. And looking from my mobile device, I can see Ray Desktop and Fine Pumpkin, which is the new one I added. I haven't renamed it yet. It gives us the crazy names until you rename it. And if I'm looking from the original desktop application, I can see Fine Pumpkin and my Android phone. And there you have it, LocalSend, a free and open source application that allows you to transfer files between all of your devices, desktop computers, mobile phones, Android, Apple, it doesn't matter. This one has really been a game changer for me, especially in creating my YouTube videos. I use multiple different computers and phones and cameras around my house on my local network. And it's really nice now to just seamlessly transfer my videos all to one place. Drop me a comment below if you've used LocalSend and what your thoughts on it are. Also drop me a comment for any future content that you would like to see. Do me a favor, please like and share the video and subscribe to the channel so I can keep bringing you content just like this. And as always, thank you for watching and until next time.